Friday night, I'm on the couch and I'm watching Netflix with my older daughters. When all of a sudden my phone starts blowing up with text messages and Facebook messages. My mom even called uh, with the news that Chadwick Boseman died. Uh, and like everybody else, I'm shocked. Like, I just remember like crying. The tears just wouldn't, wouldn't stop. And I couldn't quite figure out why. Like, um, wh why this hurt so much? Was it because the week was so heavy? It hit me. Like, all of the pain and the grief that I was feeling, it wasn't just because an actor died. It's because greatness passed away. Um, and he left a wonderful, amazing legacy. And so in reflecting on that, I came up with this. So here we go. They say not all heroes wear capes, and to your fans you offered a real life escape. You were more than the characters you played on screen. You gave a face and a voice to a whole generation that felt unseen. You taught them they could dare to dream to be more than the stereotypical images they usually see. You spoke about purpose while boldly living yours. Going places no one's gone before and leaving open doors. You soared to new heights and made it look painless. We were just starting to witness your greatness, and yet you managed to impact us for a lifetime. So many will now look to you as an ancestral lifeline, fueling their dreams to be bigger and better, the next set of trendsetters and go-getters. They don't just say Wakanda forever because it's clever or whatever. They say it because it's, it gives them hope when they're at the end of their rope, that they too can be a real life superhero with no limits on the places they will go. Our young boys and girls will imitate your art that you gave them so freely from your heart. Images of themselves as royalty, depictions of brilliance set free, black culture, compassion, excellence, integrity. Thank you Chadwick Boseman for leaving one hell of a legacy. Wakanda forever.